What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Legacy Cube draft here on. Uh, you, you know where you are. Mutual B's website. Mutual B's website. What do you want to draft, man? Good cards. Let's do it. Let's see if we can get the mono red deck. Should we make popcorn? Yes. Yes, you should. The mono red deck? Yeah, if we get it. If we get a nice open. What's a nice open for you? What do you think is the premier. Goblin Guide. Wow. Well. Oh, we didn't get there. Never mind. <laughs> well, this ain't it. Too light. Oh, this pack's interesting. You want to do? You want to alternate it again? Nah. Mushalb.org. That doesn't even sound like a real website. What's the What's the pick, man? You said you don't want to alternate? No. Let's just take the best card in each pack, and we'll talk about it. I never hope to wield dual caster. There's nothing in this like the, uh, there's chain lightning I guess for mono red, but that's not that great of a start. But maybe it's good. I think we take volcanic island. So weak though for not mono red. I do like volcanic island. I also like arcane artisan. I like Colagon's command. I'll take the volcanic. I think it's the strongest card in this pack. Uranium fever. If we had taken that, we could take Firebolt. Which is still not super impressive. I like Sphinx's Revelation. What if we're like a Jeskai control deck? I don't think Sphinx's Revelation is that strong. I'd rather just take like Fire Ice here. Or Burning Catacomb. I think we take Fire Ice and then we hope this wheels. Sure. Sphinx Rev is so good. Oh, God, I love it so much as a card. It's, it's really oh, clunky. I kind of want to play so. this. That's the guy that puts another guy into play? Yeah. And it's a 6-6 six, six Trampler for 5, which is just strong by itself. I didn't know that dude was even in the cube. Oh, man, I totally want to build around this guy. Well, we are blue and red, so... Sure. Boom! Ooh, Jace. Ooh, Jace. What if we Ilharg into Terastodon? That's pretty nasty. You mean to say it's nasty to rasty? Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Or we can jace. We can stay. We can stay safe and jace. Or we could take the champion of wits. It's true. I feel like a jace though. Why don't we just take the trash on and go for it? Done. Crater Hoof? Yeah. I mean, that, if you're going Terrasty, you might as well game. Crater Hoof, huh? I mean, so I feel sure like we just played Teamer, Island. but I'm still okay with it. Hornet Queen? This is all really hinging around us being able to cast that from that guy. Yeah, but that's okay. We're just having a good time. Copperline Gorge, Nissa. Rolesk? No, I ain't no Rolesk. Really? You can put two counters on this guy? Commander, man. Attack for four in the air. This deck is going downhill fast. How dare you? You pizza shit, you. Why don't we try to be Jund? I guess we already have the Volcanic. It's so easy to just keep this. and. Why? What would you take here? Assassin's uh, Trophy? Yeah. Trophy. I like this. I think this is real good. Okay, take it. See if I care. Jerk. Oracle. And Infernal Titan. And Huntmaster. And Warden? And Rose? This pack is bonkers. What's the pick here, Mooch? I think we just take the Oracle. I think it's Oracle too, but god, the Throne Titan's real nice. So, seven, eight, seven, five, four, three, and then two can go there for now. I guess we can have a one spot too. Uranium Michaels are gonna drink me now. How drunk is everyone? I'm sober. Oh, Biogenic Ooze. That's a solid choice. Sure. Wood Elves. We're like, should Elves. What does that mean? I don't know, you should Elves it. Definitely take the city. Should elves it? 
Yeah, shit elves it. Sounds like you're saying shit elves. Hey, look at them shit elves. Maybe I am. Yeah, when I went to a, my doctor's appointment today, and he was like, uh, do you smoke? And I'm like, no. Okay, so never. And he's like, I'm like, yeah. And he's like, uh, what about drinking? Do you drink? And I'm like, no. And he's like, not even like occasionally? Like when a drink or something? I'm like, no. And he's like, wow. All right. He's like, no wonder you're so healthy. And I was like, oh, wow. Thank you. Also, you have stage four brain cancer. Sorry about that. <laughs> Rampaging Ferocidon? Woodland? Mm. Let's take the Woodland Cemetery just in case. Mm. Okay. Okay. Let's take the Sun Petal Grove just in case. Okay. 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 The shit elves are coming home to roost. <laughs> I bet you get that reference. Is it because I'm a shit elf or am I a rooster? I thought it was because you were a Trailer Park Boys fan. That sounds like a Trailer Park Boys quote. It might be. I think that might just be an original, though. Standard beat. Is that a quote from something, or is that an original? Is that a standard beat original? He said Randy. Like, Oh, true. Oh, God. I missed that part. I want to watch some more uh, some Letter Kenny. We could. Oh, look. Venerated Loxodon. Put that dude into play with this guy. That doesn't do anything. Ooh, format of Garrick is good. Taiga is good. Taiga is pretty good. Oh, let's look. It's a nod to TPB. Okay. Garrick says he can play seven drops on turn five. Is it Taiga? It's got to be Taiga, right? Yeah, it's pretty strong. It is pretty strong. None of those five cards that we wanted in the eight card pack came back. It's unfortunate. Uranium mic bees are gonna turn me down. Going down. Uranium mic bees. Oh, ancient tomb. Also, Ulamog. Jesus. Ancient tomb's pretty strong, though. I think ancient tomb is a great here. It's very nice. Control magic's good if we are going the route of blue. Devoted Druid's just fine as well. Probably Druid. I think so too. That is the winning sword, but I think we're just more... Oh, Acidic Slime. Oh, Raging Ravine maybe though. Chandra good too. This pa These packs have been great. Your mana's okay. I think we can take a Slime Ball here. Raging is a, an attacky though. And it's also just a great dual land. I don't know. I do like Acidic Slime, though, especially if we go, like, Devoted Druid or Wood Elves. And, yeah, I'll take the Acidic Slime. I convince myself. What are, you getting, what, are you yawning? Yeah, man. How about Through the Breach? Sure. I mean, it makes all these guys good. And if we get an Emrakul, or a Kozilek, let's say. That's... What are Renin Six? No, we don't have any fetches. Yeah, I guess that's true. What about Bogart and Hellkite? Deal 5 and attack for 5? I don't know, man. Annihilate 4 is pretty strong. I guess you're... Yeah, I think that's that's for true. I don't know why this is in here. This is so weird. Like, no, it's... Put a little to count on each red planeswalker you control, which is extremely limited. Create two 1-1 one -one elementals, and there's no elemental synergies in the cube. Right, yeah. It really doesn't belong here at all. It's a very strange... Like They're like, let's put this in there. And everyone's like, why? And you're like, uh, who knows? It's a new card, so we had to put it in there. We gotta have new cards in there. Smells like Teen Spirit. That's my favorite Linkin Park song. <laughs> oh, man. That sounds that sounds pretty okay. I think the cube goes away tomorrow, though, which is really kind of frustrating. What's the pick here? I don't know, man. I don't even work here. Chalice? I think Chalice? Sure. Chally boy? Oh, Chally boy. I, I could I do not think there's an elemental deck. I don't think there's any elementals in the queue. I'm gonna take this Hydroid Crassus. Maybe we just cast it off of our volcanic island in our city of brass. I have yet to see any elementals. Yeah, let's look at all the packs and we'll count the number of elementals that we see. Let's take Bailoff. So far the count is zero. It's a goose egg. There's a jellyfish. Here's a human druid. 
I like a jellyfish. You want the jellyfish? Yeah, I like the jellyfish. <laughs> don't put it in the sideboard, man. You want main naked? Yeah. I didn't even think we were blue, man. Wow, that's a late stone for you. volcanic. Is Whisperwood Elemental an Elemental? That's interesting. The Chandra came back? That's nice. Yeah, thank you. Vasnaz. Why did... Hmm. Bro, uh, Everling Chalice is a zero drop. This doesn't actually have a converted mana cost, so I don't know why you have it in the two drop slot. Uh, it does have a converted mana cost of zero. Oh, thank God you. Dang it. God. It's hard. It's really, sometimes it's really painful to be your friend. Well, maybe if you just weren't wrong. Look, we got a Zergo. Oh, great. A Zergo butt sniffer. Is there anything good in this pack? Parsi gets Taiga. Is Immortal Sun good? We have like one Planeswalker so far. Sure. Are you being serious right now? It's okay. Yeah, take it. It's very good. What's wrong with him? Why is he like this? I don't know. These are a bunch of random memes. <laughs> he's so weird, man. God, I love him, but he's so weird. I think it's Immortal Sun. I think Immortal Sun is really powerful. It's really powerful. I put it in my power troll deck and my powerful spells and I go Dude, I feel like Mike is actually so much better at night when he's awake. Cause during the day he's just super quiet the whole time because he's like I'm falling asleep during the stream. Wow. How at night you? he's like wide awake and it's fantastic. How dare you, sir? This is like a different experience, man. Uranium fever. What are we taking here? Noble Hierarch? Well, it is. I like Vivian. We did just take Mortal Sun. We do have a lot of five drops. Maybe Power Stone? We don't have much ramp. You know what? Noble Hierarch? It doesn't produce green mana. Oh, wait, yeah, it does. Noble Hierarch? <laughs> <laughs> you don't think Noble Hierarch produces green mana? Oh, yeah, take take Noble. That's fine. Good lord. Oh, let, oh here we go. Yeah, we're going to splash there that bad is. boy. No, don't do it. Okay, let us cover Let's take the mana confluence. We already have City of Brass. So what? You gotta pay to play, buddy. This guy makes the same colors. Pay to play. No gamble, no future. No one says that. I just did. No one besides you right now. Oh, it's Rain Dynamo. I like. What about... What about Windswept Heath? It gets Taiga. It also gets... That's it. That's it. Still pretty good, though. Getting your dual land. Confluence is pretty good. Let's take Confluence. You don't like, you don't like the Rand Dynamo? I guess we do have a Kozilek. It's kind of hard to cast without it. We also have an Immortal Sun. We also have a Mortal Sun. Mortal Sun. Mortal Sun. Yeah, sure, take the Turn three Dynamo seems care. very good. Basalt Monolith. Paluki. I'm going to Basalt you. What does that mean? I don't know. Sword but of I'll Steel and Sinew. More like Sword of Shiz and Shaz. Shiz and Shaz. Oh, the old Sword of Shiz and Shaz. Is it Basalt Monolith? No. Why? It's not that great. Why? Why? <laughs> yeah, take it fine. See if I care. Why isn't that great? It's just, you have to untap it and oh. pay mana. Oh. Oh. We're definitely plowing, right? Oh, Billy. Yeah, take it. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. Take take the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Over Goblin D dwells. We have like literally uses zero things to use with that. You're right. Take this man war out. How dare you? How dare you? Smuggler's Copter could be these. Yeah, we have enough creatures for it. We do or don't? We do. We do. We do. We have enough. I like you putting the sideboard, though. because we good. have 23 cards here, so... Well, we're probably not playing Fire Ice. We got, you don't think Fire is good enough? Yeah, wait, you're right. Put that back in. Oh, my God. I'll take this throne for the sideboard. Put that Fire Ice back in, you take son of a easy. bitch. Take it easy. You son of a bitch! Plus, we have a free splash of Volcanics. So. Oh, God. I don't know if it's free. Oh, Mana Confluence came back, stupid. 
Why does that make me stupid? Because I asked. I told you to pick it. Look, when so teeth came back, stupid. Wow. Wow. Look, Nick does came back, stupid. <clears throat> I don't. That's terrible. I don't like that land at all. I don't like that land at all. It's terrible and it's not good. This is twenty three. Any format, no matter what. What? Look, Goblin Kang, get back, gang, something, dang, stupid. Goblin Kang, gang, gooby go, gooby. Is that what you said? Came back. Mike is on fire. This Mike is on. All right, on so cut over flowing chalice. Why? Okay, so put in fire and ice. Okay. And then you're gonna cut. Hold on, I'll find it. Just a minute. I'm waiting. Probably. What about P and Nalar? Oh yeah, that's good. I like that. Taiga. I might as well play this over an island, over a, a mountain just so we can have the fire ice half. Right. right. It's just basically free. Eight, mana confluence. I don't want to play both of these, though, because they're only two colors. And we have Ancient Tomb already, so... And we don't have Rafaela, so it doesn't really matter if we have a, a butt-ton of... One butt-metric ton of... Right. It's all 13, 14, 15, 16. We're basically just playing two colors, though. Right. So do we really need the mana confluence? Not really, no. No, I think we cut that. So four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Add one more to get the mana confluence. All right. I, I Din. What's wrong with you? We could splash the Crassus. I can see that. I think our deck's pretty good right now, though. I actually do like splashing that guy. I do like splashing that guy. That seems good. That seems good. Oh. <gasps> What if we did this? I was going to move to... Is this turn one chalice, but no green sources? Or oh God, I, keep, I think we keep this hand. Run no, the draw. What are you insane? <laughs> we have no colors. <laughs> oh my God! What's wrong with you? Oh. It's the last play of, of our entire match. By the way, we're gonna draw green, and then we're gonna go uh, Nissa into Lotus Cobra. Into oh, we're just gonna draw green. Go Oracle already. <laughs> Ah, uh, you're good at this game. You're very good at this game. Well, there's no there's no land on top, so that's okay. Oh, dang it. Now what do we do? We'll play Nissa. What after that? Play land, play Little Tiger. Cobra. Seems good. Can't do that. Why not? Because <laughs> that's not I on demand this. it. Did you say I demand it? Yeah. Iron Man it? Oh, yeah, Iron Bandit. The Iron Bandit? Let's get the Iron Bandit. Let's get a red and... Oh, we can't play Pig. Dang it. We can play Through the Breach, play Pig, play Hornet Queen off of Pig. Hornet Queen bounces, so does Ilharg. Yeah, let's do that. I mean, that doesn't seem terrible. We do have to lose our Pig, but... No, but then it gets tucked back in. What? It gets tucked back in. Why? Because that's literally how these cards work. What are you talking about? What's the matter with you? Doesn't the pig... Yeah, when it dies, you put it in the Internet Search Library, throw it from the top. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know I had that ability. This is also 12 damage, so they go to 8 here. Sure. Uh, yes. And Hornet Queen comes back, and we still have 3, 4, 5, 6. So any land, we just get to replay Hornet Queen. And they're at 8, and we have Lethal on board. Wow. Uranium fever. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. We'd have to hit this again. We could just also play Chandra as well. One, two, three. So we go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're one away from actually casting both of these. I actually want to use this first, though, in case they have a removal spell for 
our creatures. So we're going to say green. Yeah, let's say red and we'll just play Chandra here. Because the two damage from Chandra means that... Um, oh, do we just play that? No, I'm just going to deal them two here. They're at six, so now they have to remove two threats. Uh, even not plus Chandra's lethal because we have eight power. So if they have one removal spell to kill a creature... Through the Breach. Defensive through the Breach. Crystal Brand. That's pretty good. Yeah, that ain't terrible. They can't draw cards, though. Oh, they can. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess they could. Eh, that wasn't... I mean, we just traded Nissa for through the Breach and Crystal Brand. It's not terrible. Hmm. That'll do. Wow, this match was this was this game was crazy. Remember you were like, don't keep this hand, and I was like, I'm keeping it. I like to live dangerously, Michael. Well what can you say? What can you say? What you can, can you say? say? Oh, that you only meant well, but of course you did. That you only man well? Yeah, you only man well. Oh hi Mark. <laughs> That's so perfect. I didn't plan that. I just uh, randomly. Oh, burped. I know. I caught it like in mid burp. Yeah, I'll keep this hand. You ready for the devoted? Uh, bailout doesn't seem super relevant. Oh God. Oh Jesus. <laughs> I'm in danger. Danger. Wait, they didn't do anything? Um, Wait, what happened? I guess they just passed their turn. Oh, Alright, sure. Are they missing a land draw? Uh, yeah, I guess no? so. That's weird because they faithless looting. Here comes the... Uh, Shree animate? Yep. That's pretty good. Hmm. Well, I think we're dead. Mm, what you say? Oh, that's your gristle brand. Well, but of course you did. What you say? Yeah, gristle brand is pretty good on turn three. You're not wrong. Mm, I had a feeling I wasn't. Why do you end of the turn? It doesn't make any sense. Like, it's so weird when people do that. They're like, end of your turn, I'll draw seven. But why? Like, you can just do it during your turn after you draw your card. Night Mike really is best Mike. This is when he's most awake. It's when all the cocaine's flowing through his body. <laughs> well, someone's got to do it. So you don't dis... Yeah, but you're still... That has nothing to do with if you do it during your upkeep or not. If you do it during the end of my turn or during your upkeep, you're still not discarding your cards. I'm gonna go to the next game. Theoretically, we could take a seven. Play well thought. Well thought. Could have played these guys, but well thought. Well thought. Well thought. Are you okay? All right. So. Any graveyard heat? Nope. No. That's a big no for. We can play this mana war. Uh huh. And then what? I mean, it bounces their creature. Brand City and Mana Confluence. Woo! My cocaine? My cocaine? <laughs> My cocaine? Wow, we have two jellyfish on our sideboard. We have Mana War and Hydroid Crassus. Jelly, 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 jellyfish. He's so weird, guys. What's what? What are you talking about? Watch what? What is oh, this? I like right how that. Yeah, that's good. What mm. is this? Mm. Oh god, it's moving. What is this? Oh wow, I guess I can just move it anywhere I want. Oh, that's strange. Okay. Not anymore though. Now it's stuck. I guess that's where it is. Oh god. 
Oh, one. Wait. Oh, one. Oh, here it is again. I'll just put it up here. No, nope. it's like the preview panel. That's that's not weird at all. That's weird. Did, you Did we just skip our? St oh God! Yeah, you just you done goofed. Well, we're not beating shoulder anyway, so I don't I don't really feel that bad. I guess. Oh God. How much power that got? Six. Hmm. That's a lot. It's not a little bit, yeah. Yeah. Hey, look, we have something to sacrifice. <laughs> yeah. Lucky us. Ain't that cute. And we can still block. We can't block anymore. That's good. I don't like blocking. It's for suckers. You're for suckers. You're a stupid head. Got him. Oh, that's amazing. That's actually really <laughs> good. So we can put the boar into play and then put Kozlik into play, right? And they have to sacrifice four permanents. Does that oh, work that way? God, yes. No, because no, no, no. You have to put Kozlik into play. Uh, if you put the boar in, it's, it comes into play attacking. So you wouldn't so you get the, the annihilator. annihilator. But we would actually probably just win because they're at 13. Yeah, because that'd be Kozlik's 12. Yeah, we could have just won, actually. But, 12, 13, I mean, nonetheless, 14. like, this is still pretty nuts. Yeah, that and they go to one. Damage. So, wow. Wow. <laughs> and now we just get to cast Razebor, I guess. Or we can cast Immortal Sun. Don't you want to, like, kill him? Oh, we can just kill him with Chandra. How yeah. about that? I guess Seems we can. Better. Let's look at all the cards in our hand and figure out which one kills them. What even happened? Remember that time we skipped our second turn? Oh, gosh. That was a fast game, man. Dude, let me tell you about Through the Breach. It can be pretty unfair sometimes. That was a good game. That was a good match. I uh, was, uh, Both sides fought hard. I felt, I, yeah. We were both trying to do the most broken thing as fast as possible. You know what our opponent, our opponent was like? Not great, Bob. And I was like, yeah, that's not great, Bob. I feel like this coaster is doing the pool thing. The pool thing? Yeah. It's made of sandstone. It's maybe it just can't absorb it as fast as you can, as you can, drink it. Uh, drink it and sink it. I'm gonna keep this hand because we have raised bore into Hornet Queen again. Throw the beach and raised bore is into into another creature is pretty nuts. It's not bad. It's also like a lot of damage out of nowhere. Oh my god! I love that Dan's recognized the comeback. That's amazing to me. Uh, I'm just gonna play Tiger here. Dan, thank you for the bits. You are my favorite. Oh, Roar Espada, thank you so much for the bits, man. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. You guys are great. I love you guys. Or as the kids say, Preesh. Preesh is right. Throughout the time they were like, she old red, and we're like, all right, I'll just kill you. Yeah, that was pretty good. It felt good while it was happening. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Through the breach into Ilharg into Terastodon. How much is that? That's, is that better? That's 15 damage. Maybe. Do we want to give them elephants, though? No, we kill our own things and get, like, three three threes on turn three. Because we're going to be able to play it next turn with Ancient Tomb. One, two, three, four, five. Or we can just play Immortal Sun next turn. Uh, it's made of sandstone, idiot. <laughs> well, blowing up three of your lands is a little risky, though. I'll blow up their lands then. I don't care. Michael, I'm blowing up something. I think the Hornet Queen play is just better. You hit lands? You're top decking spells? Am I watching the right channel? I don't think so. You think Hornet Queen's better? No, you're right. Just smash them for a million. This dude's got nine power. Kill their library. I was thinking that, but then they got a blocker. I'd almost rather just kill through my things, deal them 15, put them to three, and then we have three three threes. Yeah, I like that. Plus, like, they're playing red green. What are they going to do? Right. I mean, anger of the gods is like the scariest thing they can do here. Let's go for it. Yeah, three green up. What are they going to do? Or do we just play Die. this? Do we just play this naturally? Why? Well, because then we don't lose it next turn. It just stays on the board. Yeah, but this way we just kill them and kill them. Into, like, they, there's no way they're coming back from that if you, if you do it where you play through the breach. Like, there's just no way. 
Like you're basically just giving him a turn for no reason. All right, Michael. I'll get behind what you're saying. Michael Gain. Michael Gain. Go for it. No gamble, no future. They go to three, so they have to block all three of our creatures. All right. <clears throat> I'm actually not going to tuck this guy because we don't have the mana form yet. You think? <laughs> Look at those little cuties. <laughs> Alright, we're doing it. We're living the dream. Got there. Wow. Dude, through the breach, Ilhark has been insane so far. Yeah, it's a potent combo. Jesus. Because you basically get a double through the breach, right? Yeah, you get two through the breaches. You get It's like, it adds plus six damage to through the breach. And the card you're putting into play the second time just goes back to your hand anyway, so it's not like it's... It's going on my hair over here. It's like a little... Okay. A little hairy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get a zoom in on that. <laughs> Just incredible, man. Just absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, get a zoom in on that. I'm just gonna submit. I don't think we're in. It's through or the breach. You ever? You've heard of through <laughs> the breach, but have you ever heard of through or the breach? It just sounds like you're saying the same thing. I'm going to be honest with you. Have you heard of Through the Breach? You've, you've heard of Through the Breach, but you have you heard of Through the Breach? Did you just say the same thing? Did you say through the, breach, through the Breach again? Uh, I don't love it, but I don't hate it. I think our deck is good enough to to do it. Oh, they mulligan to six? Oh, they're dead. Yeah, man. They're dead. Is Copter supposed to be in our deck? Yeah, it's probably fine. Look at that little, look at that little idiot. Yeah, because if we draw like Wood Elves the turn after this, it's great. I'm gonna pump up my tree speaker. Oh Jesus, fire! Oh God, fire would've been so good, but alas, we're probably dead. Yeah. What was this one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight? Yep, that's that's good. That's a good. This is a real magic card. Yeah, if they have a forest, they have eight mana. Even if they don't, they have one, two, three, four, five, six mana. <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> <laughs> this is like the first match. I'm always in danger. That's my secret, Michael. And they're tanking long too. They're like, hmm, yeah, but they have more than the no, most. They did. They only have three cards. Well, what's the difference between six and eight, really, right? <laughs> uh, Woodfall Primus, Hornet Queen. There's three. There's five. There's five. It's gonna be acidic slime. Oh, Primal Command of Land. It's really not it's, that. It's good because no, because they get a huge fat idiot now. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's unfortunate. Does it go on the top of our deck, or where does yeah. it go? Oh, that's gross. Right, so now they get to do whatever. They basically, it's basically a literal time walk. Yucks. What are they going to get, though? You can't sleep? That's too bad. I know that feeling, man. I can't sleep. Oh, they're just going to kill our other land. That's cool. I like that. I'm really into that. I think we just concede, right? Uh, You mean because they're going to play Woodfall Primus? Yeah. Probably, yeah. And we know what we're drawing, so we're... Effectively dead in the water. Drawing dead, as it were. Drawing dead in the water. Dead on the water. Smoke on your mother. Smoke on your mother. Mother's in the sky. Oh, look, they did it. I hope they kill the smuggler's copter. Yeah, me me too. I hope they do that. Even if they did, I don't... Joke's on you, buddy. I got another land. I mean, they go six. We go 13. We go land. Uh-huh. They put us to seven, we go fourth land. They put us to one, we go fifth land. Through the breach, ill hard hornet queen. What they gonna what they gonna do now? Kill us with their trampling guy still? That's true. That's <laughs> probably what they'll do. I mean, we could draw like I don't know. We'll see what happens, I guess. The, the fire in What's the wrong sky? with you tonight, man? <laughs> <laughs> God. You know, like my burps. I think the people appreciate it. No one appreciates anything that you're talking about. What oh, this is this is like, yeah, I got nothing to do with this guy, so All right, now we're Dobbs, so. Don't say Dobbs. You don't like dead, dead on boards? No, I don't like Dobbs. <laughs> hey, you like, you like I Dobbs? I, in fact, hate Dobbs. That's aggressive. Mike, if you were a salami sandwich, who, who would you want to eat you? Well, that would just kill me, so probably no one. 
Would it be your mother? No. Okay. What about your father? Definitely not. Joke's on you. He ain't even around. Oh, maybe I should say my dad because he'll never eat me because he's never around. God, so therefore, I'd live forever. Joke's on you, dad. I'm an invincible salami sandwich. I'm an invincible salami sandwich. <laughs> well, you should save that salami sandwich for your mommy. <laughs> I put in Manowar. Oh. How do you feel about that? Oh, I forgot uh, to. Oh, no, I forgot to land. Did you already submit? Yes. We made a mistake. I'll probably just never draw it, so it'll probably be irrelevant. And an opener. No, it's not. Okay. Wow, this hand's great, though. It's pretty good. Turn two, Nessa. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. <laughs> Against the green deck, this is great, because now we get to do this jobby. And then the other jobby. And, and then jobby all the lobbies. So many jobbies. What needs to go on the board? Mike's salami sandwich? <sighs> Fire. Oh, that might be better. One, two. Yeah, that's probably better because we can play Mortal Sun next turn. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Uh, oh, we can play Acidic Slime next turn, actually. I'm going to take one just so I can deal one. Smoke on your mother. If we can draw a land, is it better to play Mortal Sun or is it still better to Acidic Slime? That's the question. Uh, I just, Depends on what they play. Oh, now, now it's you, Acidic now Slime. Slam that slime, boy. Just give me a land. Land, 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 land. Oh, it's not a land. You can still do it, right? Yeah, you can still do it. And we're 100% doing it. Don't say you're not going to do it. Boom. Two for one, you. Yeah. Oh, that's so brutal. Now you know how I feel, Primal Command. One, two, three. One, two. Oh, come on. We got another one, huh? God, they're so, they're so greedy. Can I blink this guy? That would be good. Schmiskit. Sh Smoke on the water. Ba -der -ba -der -ba -der -der. Let's get a taiga. Taiga? <laughs> Think they'll block? God, I hope so. So next turn they have one, two, three, four, five, assuming they play land. Yeah. It's not terrible. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight if they don't do anything to this, which they did not, but no. Oh, can... yowza. Yep, that's pretty bad. That's actually not the worst. It's still pretty bad. Not really, because now we have six mana, we can just play Mortal Sun. This goes away, and they have nothing left. Well, they might have other things to sneak us at. Sneak at us. Sneak us at. Hey, don't sneak us at. One, two, three, four, five. I guess we just hope we don't die. Yeah, hopefully they don't have something with eight power. That's what we're... Dan's, have a good night, buddy. Always a pleasure. I oh. appreciate you. Yeah, I'm not really. That's a 2-1. I'm not. That's <laughs> fine. I ain't feeling you, 2-1. They're going to level their guy up or whatever? No, that costs five. Was it worth sneak attacking that guy? It doesn't seem great. I mean, granted, it does do us two damage, but... Ooh. Ooh. Man, I felt so good about that acidic slime on the land, too. I mean, we're not dead. Is that cracking this guy? I think I just cracked that coercive portal. Sure. It's pretty it's good. It's a little, a little scary. Is it? That's no bueno. Play Nissa. Do anything. It gets us a blocker, which could be super relevant. Also thins out our deck a little. We could also play uh, Chalice for one, and then play Nissa. Yeah, sure, yeah, that's better. Might as well. Actually, this costs one less. I suppose you cast costs one less to cast. 
So can we play this for three? Yeah, let's do that. Let's go. Does that work that way? Yeah, because multi kick is gonna be four, and it reduces the cost by one. And then we can play Nissa for two. Okay. Smoke on the water. Michael in the skies. Homage. I'll say Carnage. Got him. Did you get him? No, it didn't do anything. Uh, we do not have Eternal Witness in the deck. That would be sick because otherwise you could just acidic slime in. It's hoping they don't like Gristlebrand this or something. I don't think they're going to play Gristlebrand. I think they want to keep the cards that they can cast. But that's just maybe maybe I'm wrong. Well, they're definitely going to slam a Gristlebrand if they were at five. So. Shut up, Michael. Are they attacking? I mean, I'm blocking. If they want to pump, like, it's fine. Yes, yeah, their whole turn. Are you ready for this? Well, that would just kill me, so probably no one. Would it be your mother? No. Okay. What about your father? Definitely not. Joke's on you. He ain't even around. Oh, maybe I should say my dad because he'll never eat me because he's never around. God. So therefore, I live forever. Joke's on you, dad. I'm an invincible salami sandwich. <laughs> I'm an invincible salami sandwich. <laughs> uh, well, you should funny. save that salami sandwich for your mommy. So I'm an invincible salami sandwich. What'd you say? Well, how big is your guy? 5-4 and Rose is a 3-5. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. This guy costs seven. Guess we're passing. Passing and sassin. What? What? Yes. What does that mean? Hmm. Let me know which one you think here. I like the baby one. This one? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, deal. Hmm. If this is what they're playing this turn, I feel like. Oh. Fudge. Okay, well, we're dead. Hmm. 9, 16. We can block 4. <laughs> Doing okay. the math in my head. Just one. <laughs> oh God. The same way that Trump has kept it going. What the hell does that mean? I have no idea, dude. All right, let's try again. Should try again. Should 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 try again. On Trump Tuna, I thought you had a regular sub. These games have been quick, boy. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate you. Is you smashing know. or getting smashed? That's the story of your life, man. <laughs> wow. It makes no sense. I don't understand it at all. Yeah, I don't. That response didn't make any sense to me. I asked you how he started this thing, and your response was someone else did something. What? That's pretty accurate, though. <laughs> I will play first. Oh, yeah. I'll keep it. Yeah, we can through the breach our Oracle. I could turn three Oracle. Oracle! <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Prime uh, or tier one doesn't even matter. They all they all work the same for me. I'm okay with either. Did you, just, did you burp? What? You disgusting pig. <laughs> oh, I have an Ophiomancer. My name is Kai Kade Kaden. I have Mop Ophiomancer. Do you like this? These noises I'm making? I was the one making the noises. Exactly. Oh, look, a beef. A, a beef. beef. <laughs> Look at this one beef. Oh, oh, oh. Well, that makes our crater cost five, and you really only need them for one turn, so. If we go ooze into beef, I think we're probably fine. <laughs> ooze into beef. 
I love my ooze and beef. <laughs> when we were at the Wawa and Mike was getting his drink, he's like, one day I won't get high C orange. But it is not today. And I was like... It just tastes so delicious. It is very good. And it's so nutritious. Oh, Jesus. They sack elf and... Wow, I guess they do. Wait, they don't? Why do they... What's the point of putting one... Oh, because they're going to make another snake and sack that to it. Yeah, that's very good. Oh, but wait. But wait. But wait. They didn't do that. Okay, so I guess we just get to play our lands then. That's nice. I have no... What? Why? All right, we slam the ooze. Next turn, we do... Do the breach into this guy? Yeah, and uh, Crater Hoof. Oh, boy. Wait, does Crater Hoof still get the trigger? Uh, when it enters, yeah, because it's an enters battlefield trigger. Okay. Just want to make sure. Oh, Jesus. What are you doing right now? They paid a life. Are they dismembering? Sure. Why do they keep paying life? Because they're sacking, they're clicking on this to sack creatures. Sure. They're at 15, though. I think Crater have no harder. Yeah, it would be so much further behind if they actually killed our Oracle and upkeep. Like, yeah, that wouldn't have been. Game would be so much I'm different. surprised they didn't. I can't think of a reason why they wouldn't do that. I'll take a number 14, ooze and the beef, please. Can I get an ooze and a beef? Can I get a, let me get a large ooze and a beef? So this is what, five? Wait, where did Ilhard go? It's on top of our deck. Oracle died. Oh, I was like, okay, I understand. I understand. Oh, is this enough? This has got to be enough, right? They all get trampled too. There's a lot of blockers though. Let's do some math here, right? We got six, 11, 12, 13, uh, three, six, nine, 22 damage. So what? Six, seven, eight has to get through. No, they can no. It's eight over, so four, five. So it wouldn't kill them, but it definitely puts them in a bad spot. Yeah, it forces them like in a bad spot and they have to block with a bunch of their dudes and it's definitely worth it, I think. Sure. Also Crater Hoof comes back to the hand. That's cool, man. <laughs> hey, man, that's real cool. Yeah, they serve that at Arby's. You get the ooze and the beef with the curly fries. I wonder if they just kill this guy. They know we have this, too, because they saw it, right? They should. If they know, we're attacking for 22. If they get rid of two blockers, though, it seems bad. Can I get a boop boop? Or a schmoop schmoop. A boop boop or a schmoop schmoop. You heard it here first, guys. Bang. They're going to let us get all the... Oh, man. That's not good. You don't want to let us get all that extra power and toughness. 9 plus 8, 17 plus 5. I think they can survive. It's 22... But everything they have dies. Everything they love dies. So they go to four, and Ilhard goes on top. And we still have a 2-2, two -two and they're at four. So that's... You do have a lot of cards in hand, though. Okay. Cool. Like a whole seven, because... Yogmoth is kind of annoying. Dread Return? Who even plays Dread Return on Drum Tuna? Who even does that? Oh no, not a Tassiger. No, oh, that's a good one. What can we top deck here that's good? Are you ready? Waiting. We have seven mana. Like, there's a lot of draws we can have that are very, very good. Can we get a Hornet Queen? That'd be sick. People who are undreamt. What about tunas that are undreamt? That's, that's 
it's really close to being what we want. Wow. Maybe they won't block. Uh, queen is three green. Is it not? It's not four green, right? Three green. Yeah, Horny Queen's not four green. That's insane. And my son? You don't even have a son. You don't know that. What? What? Yeah, big surprise. Undreamt Tuna Jr. Wow. <laughs> That's not even a real person. Man. Oh my god, what if they took two there? I would have lost, oh, my, would have lost my mind. That would have been super epic, bro. Are you just going to activate this? Um, I want to give you Liliana the Veil because I actually think that's better than the Scavenging Goose. Scavenging Goose gains you life and I don't care about you gaining life at this point. Well, you do care about them gaining life. Is what that's what, yeah, that's what I meant. I don't want you gaining life at this point. Man, imagine if they attacked. That'd be sick. No, no chance. Equip sword and attack. That'd be gross. Well, then they'd kill this guy though with the sword. So, but they also don't have the mana to do that. Are you okay? <coughs> yeah. <laughs> you okay? Oh my god, they didn't attack. That's so sad. All right, so the next card is not ill hard. We got one. Oh, that's great. That's actually very good. Yeah, usually drawing two cards a turn. Pretty good. And it's a 3-3 now. We could actually attack and then shoot the Tassiger, which seems pretty good. Because we're going to have to discard this Teliliana anyway. And they kind of have to block here. Yeah, this is great. So now their sacrifice doesn't do anything. The discard doesn't do anything. Yeah, but they get to keep oh, it. Oh, no. They can't even activate Liliana. Oh, yeah. That's actually great because oh, it would geez. be super relevant because the turn we play Ilharg, they would they would just minus. Um, oh. That's unfortunate. Wow. That's Don't so... click no. But if I click no, we draw the Ilharg. Oh, okay. Actually, yeah. Click no. I don't know if that does it, though. Well, the problem is if we play Ilharg... They're going to play Liliana, make us discard, and then the next turn they'll just use minus two to kill it, right? Well, they're going to make us kill the they're going to kill the Ilharg. With right, exactly, yeah. So, I don't know. Is a random card better than Ilharg, though? Probably. That's so frustrating. Wow, Assassin's Trophy was so dumb. Yeah, that card's pretty good. Them drawing so many cards is really the problem. Oh, yeah, because the stupid Yawgmoth. Yeah. That could let you draw a card. The card's very good. It's something, all right. Oof. That's a good draw. Hornet Queen. Hornet Queen! That's probably our best draw. This is going to be a land, so... <laughs> Effectively a land... Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we have a, we can actually cast Kozilek now if we draw Kozilek. That's pretty cool. That's something, all right. Oh God. Oh Jesus. This is all fine. It's not really fine. It's not terrible. We still have live draws. Kozilek is card advantage. Jeez. Jeez. Yeah, but they just like kill it. Oh, come on. Yep, that's the end. 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Wow, that's so stupid. All right, I get it. Actually, now that we've seen Liliana, I want this Bayloth in here. Yeah, we'd probably replace something. 
Smuggler's Compass Sure, seems more? yeah. Copter's good, but like you have to have it and plus like a dork. You're a dork. It's useless. Wow. Got him. Denmark, what's going on, buddy? Michael Beals. Michael B. Do, 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 do. I'm going to play first. You like it? You like that, Michael? I'm going to keep this hand. Is this round three? Yes. Wow, this has been fast. This has only been yeah, 55 minutes. Our first two games were really quick. Our first two games were really quick. I hate you. I hate you. Oh. Did you like that? See what I did there? Mm -mm. See what I made fun of you? No. I don't know what you're talking about. I think you do. I have no idea. I think you know. I don't know. What are you talking about? I want you to think about it. Think about it real long, buddy. What's wrong with you? Is that Baby Shark? Let's draw a red source. I like a red source. Oh boy. That's annoying. That's pretty good though. Baby shark. Don't be something good. That's fine. Why? What are you saying? Sure. Oh, <laughs> I have to get that song out of my... I don't, actually. I do not. I am unaware. Acidic Slime onto this seems pretty good, right? You mean on their... Bitter Blossom? Yes, Michael. Then yes. Baby Shark. Also, Acidic Slime is an ooze, so Biogenic Ooze will oh, pump nice. it. Ooze combo! Also, uh, every time they have Bitter Blossom and Yawgmoth, it just blows my mind. It's such a good combination. Yeah, it's pretty good. That's pretty good, boss. Hey, boss. Hey, boss. Ha! Got him! Glad we killed the Bitter Blossom. Speak of the Jeez. devil. Well, on the right side, they only have one creature, so this is going to get through. Shatter and Yawgmoth Ophiomancer is also filthy. Yes. Any recurring creatures is real good with that guy. Michael Beach. Michael Bees. Put counters on all my boys. It's your boy. It's your boy. Whew. There you go. Take a breath. Take a breath. Whew. Take it deeper. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We need six green though. We're two green away. Oh wait, we just got this guy. Oh, they just conceded. Because we can make maybe because we can make two oozes a turn. It's Seems still good. weird concede. I mean, they're fifteen. They have like decent blockers. They can't beat uh, like biogenic ooze is a card that just gets out of control. Out of control. Yeah, out of control. Yeah. How's it work today? It's the three weeks in which we can't listen to music with instruments, so we're only listening to acapella. And what song comes on from this Jewish acapella group? Bad. Had a bad day. So you had a bad day. What can you do? So, Mike, I heard you had a bad day. Why can you not listen to... Why can you only listen to acapella groups at work? Is that like a weird thing you guys do? Who's you guys? The people she works with, or he, she or he works with. 
on drum tuna explain the uh the three weeks that you can't listen to instrument music I think this is fine even though it's slow it's really slow I don't like it I kept it you know why yeah but we get that new mulligan where you get the C7 creeper what does that mean what are you saying right now they went to six so they just lose good for them Oh, dang, we don't lose anymore. They played a creature. <laughs> God, this game's changing every second. If we can draw, like, Noble Hierarch, it's unreal. Did you hear what I said? No. Come on, let's go. Go where? I don't know. To your mom's house. Why would you do that? Dear God, man. Get Dear it God, together. man. Dear God, man. God, man. Dear God, man. Please provide me with infinite kettle corn chips. Thank you. Goodbye. There's no corn in the chips. <laughs> They're not kidding. There's no corn, corn in chips. chips, I say. There was a tabernacle that was destroyed by the Greeks, and it was the second one for the Jews that hasn't been rebuilt. To mourn the loss of such a holy place, they don't do anything celebratory, such as weddings, haircuts, wear new clothes, or listen to music that isn't a cappella. There's a lot more to it, but that's the TLDR. Okay. I thought it was just a weird work thing. <laughs> I think you're a weird work thing. I think you're stupid. Shit, he got me. He said I was stupid. Yeah, that's right, buddy. I'm not old your buddy, buddy pal. Old pal. Oh god, are you little really little? gonna go Ophiomancer into th into Young Moth again? Yeah, because we're basically locked out of the game. Oh god. Why don't you attack with his snake? Why don't you attack with your snake, stupid? Okay, well that's unbeatable. <sighs> All three games in a row, boys. It's not a two-two, right? I think we just kill the Ophiomancer, and then next turn we can play Chandra and kill the Yog Moth. It's the best option. Sure, you got it. Uh. Dude, you are absolutely disgusting. You disgusting pig! Hit him with that no you? What does that even mean? Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. Something. Out am I. You know what that's from? No, I just quoted it, but I have no idea what it's from. You can know what it, you can, you can know what it is, but then not know what you it is. You can know what it is, but then not know what it is. I'm something of a scientist myself. <laughs> Has Mike ever farted into the mic? I don't think so. Not yet. Even that's beyond his... Uh, it would just be awkward. I'd have to like, stand on a chair or something. Like Milk from the Puppy. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> Remember Milk of the Puppy? <laughs> Vaguely. You will. You will be. You know, you're Yoda from Star Wars? Who, who's Star Wars? S Steve Star Wars. Remember him? Oh, Steve. He was the yeah, main character. I love Steve Star Wars from, uh, from Nobleman. Right? I don't know what that is, but yeah. You know, that movie series, Nobleman? Literally no idea what you're saying right now. Mm, that's too bad. It's pretty, it's, 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 it is. I agree with you. Seems not looking good for us, man. Boy, boy, you ain't kidding. Kill the sword? Oh, God, yes. Oh, God, yes. Oh, great Grammy McBammy, I'm killing that sword for Shammy. Grammy McBammy, I'm killing that sword for Shammy. <coughs> Yoder. Like milk of magnesia? Milk of the puppy? <laughs> well, it's milk of the poppy, not puppy, but, you know. Isn't puppy? We're dead. Did you think it was puppy? Yeah. 
No, it's poppy, like opiates, like opium. Milk hmm. of the poppy. Hmm. Thought it was poppy. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't stop. <laughs> 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 thought it was poppy. <laughs> Learn something new every day. It's like that YouTube series, Smarter Every Day. <laughs> Milk That's... of the puppy. <laughs> so I really oh, thought it was that. Shit, I can't, dude. What did you think Milk of the Puppy was? I don't know. I just thought it was called that. I didn't know why. Oh, God. Thank you guys for watching. Check out CoolStuffInc.com for my articles every Wednesday. Check out Manitraders.com for a sweet subscription service. And you can use the promo codes and the links down below in the description. Also, slam those like and subscribe buttons, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for being here.